Okay, guys, first up, um, contact Avalanche Software and Warner Brothers Games. Tell them, screenshot, take, go into Steam, screenshot this, tell them that, A, if you're, if anyone's from Australia and such, this is not allowed. The game, the Lux edition of Hogwarts Legacy comes out on the 7th. That is a given fact. The standard edition of Hogwarts Legacy comes out on the 10th. That is a given fact. This date is completely another freaking bullshit and should not actually be here. That should be back to the 10th. And if Steam comes out, so we have to do it because of US release, they can be screwed permanently. So, Steam's in trouble right now. And I'm glad I caught this because, A, I was going to buy the Hogwarts Lazy Deluxe Edition. But if I have to wait until the 8th, I might as well build a gaming PC for it. So, please, contact Avalanche Software, Warner Brothers Games. I'm going to... I'm going to screenshot this and tell them both what the hell is happening with Steam. Why is Steam saying this when it's this date and this date, even in Australia? Because if you actually saw the title, we are now actually going to be talking exclusive stuff. So, you you will have seen a little something down here. Please keep in mind, New Zealanders who have JB Hi-Fi, who have actually pre-ordered the game at JB Hi-Fi, you might want to cancel that pre-order and go to your local EB game store to actually get this. The Hogwarts Legacy Deluxe Edition includes the EB Games exclusive Hogwarts Keyring. Yours truly has actually got the... Xbox Series X version. And yes, that is actually... Uh, requires internet. No, it does not require internet. The only thing that it requires internet for is for the downloading of the... What is it? Uh, virtually just this pack and the Onyx Griffin. Hippogriff, I should say. That's virtually it. Just that, that, that is it. Now that we have the EB games out of the way, and I know a whole lot of people are actually going to be uh, pissed and jealous of Australia and New Zealand EB games, here's the reason why everyone else should actually be really jealous. Yes, that is the JB Hi-Fi Hogwarts Legacy Deluxe. Pin Badge Edition. Yours truly has got this. It's locked in. It's waiting for me to be... For it, me to go in on the day it comes out, on the 7th. To pick this up. Come home. Install it. Let it install my PS4. Grab the DLC. Pack. Oh, and the Day 1 Patch. So I am going to have to let the Xbox version and the PS4 version update. So I might do the PS4 version first. So that way I have something to actually play offline at night. Then I can do the Xbox Series X version. And then just go from there. Because it comes, like I said, Hogwarts Legacy Deluxe Pin Badge Edition. Now, you're probably wondering, why is it exclusive only to the Deluxe Editions? Well, that's because it is. And Deluxe Editions is the same price as the normal Deluxe Edition. So, I have $79 for the 
to pay off on this. I have, what is it, eighty nine ninety five. Pay off on this, though I am actually going to say, hey, hang on, hang on. JP Hi-Fi has the same game for $89. I will price match that. Thank you very much. Which means I'll only have to, let's see, 100, if my math is correct. And always double check. So I only have to put, uh, let's see, what is it, $58.05 towards my EB Games one of Hogwarts Legacy Deluxe Edition. And yes, that's Australian. But like I said, this is exclusive stuff. So I've actually checked Game, GameStop, Best Buy, Amazon, Costco. And Walmart for all, all for everyone. And the funny thing is, you're not getting anything. That's the joke. You're virtually not getting anything. Just uh, grab the receipt I have. I'm not showing the receipt for my for the pre order. Oh, okay. I gotta put money on one lay by this week. So, there's that. I do have a pre-order for something that comes out 14 days after um, Halloween. And yeah, that will be um, that will be reviewed. Uh, here we are. PS4 Hogwarts Legacy Deluxe JB Hi-Fi Exclusive Release date 7th of the 2nd 2023 And that is for Hogwarts Legacy So yeah That is for JB <laughs> So that's mine. That is mine. I do have the uh, the Xbox One. That's on my account with VB Games. So I definitely know how much I'm paying for that. So yeah, everyone can be. Uh, everyone can go. Haha, we got better. Um, Australia actually got a lot more better. That collector's edition, you don't get the key ring. So those who actually bought the collector's edition may want to actually uh, think about it. Do you really want the collector's edition with that big chunk of plastic book? Or do you want the key ring? Because if people go, oh, I'd rather the one. Hey, congratulations. What are you going to do with that big chunk of plastic that it sits on and floats? Above? So yeah, when both editions actually do come out, like I said, I will be picking them up. Um, little confirmation. 
as well. For Nintendo Switch, yes, that is the 31st of the 12th, 2023. That is for both the standard and deluxe editions. So, don't complain. And the reason I'm showing this one is because it was right next to the standard edition. But it's the same price, anyway. Same price. $89, $89. That one's going to be pre-ordered next year. So, without further ado, yes, those are the pins for the budget for each house. Like I said, without further ado, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notification. I'm actually going to go hunt this down somewhere. Though if I do actually get it for PS4, um, I'm just going to be happy. Okay. Um, anything else I need to... Oh yeah, that's right. Comment down below. Why do you think Australia is getting two exclusives? Then rather than New Zealand, or give you a thought on why Australia is actually getting the best exclusive bonuses than your country. I would love to read the comments. And please do not bash, do not go off at me or anything. I'm just showing you what Australia is getting, and what I will be reviewing when I get it. So do keep in mind that not everything is as what it is. I'm just doing it. You know, yeah, no. Nah. That's not going to work. I thought I'd be able to um, remove the this and the tabs, but nah, it's not going to work. Anyway. I'm going to um, probably finish reading this. God knows I need to finish it anyway. <laughs> uh, I'm also going to try and finish something else as well. Anyway, I'm out of here like a firebolt.